<sighs> Boy, today's a lazy day, but still gotta do parkour. What, you think those vaults were kind of lazy? Well, that's what we're gonna learn today, the lazy vault. Let's get started. So the lazy vault may not be the fastest vault, but it works great for when you're trying to incorporate flow into a parkour run or combo. Sometimes if you just do a move and land at a weird angle facing the rail, you can almost always pull it into a lazy vault. So I would recommend that you learn the lazy vault both directions, off your left hand and your right hand. When starting out, you're simply going to approach the handrail at an angle and then place your nearest hand on the handrail and you're going to jump off your opposite foot. And as you're jumping off that foot, your other leg is actually going to kick and kind of swing over the handrail. Now as your legs are going over the handrail, you begin to bring your opposite hand back behind your back so that you can switch hands and grab the handrail and push off again. You also need to lean back slightly so that you can get your legs up over the rail and just rely on your arms as you pass the rail behind your back to allow you to bring your feet back down on the ground. So as long as you have a solid grab, you shouldn't have to worry about not landing this trick. So now that we've learned the lazy vault, go put your pajamas on, head outside, and practice the lazy vault. Thanks for watching.